Hey Juvenile here, playing some Call of Duty Black Ops. Uh, this is going to be a game of Team Deathmatch on launch. Um, this was in like the first uh, probably like week that Black Ops came out. Uh, I don't like ever use Delia with a reflex sight anymore. Uh, it's not that bad, but I, I prefer extended mags. Um, this is going to be a game where I go 24-0. There's a little bit of camping, but eh, what can you do? I mean, it's Black Ops. They spawn behind you. The enemy spawns behind you every 24 seconds of the game. It's it. They it did a good job of um, eliminating spawn camping in Team Deathmatch by consistently switching spawns back and forth and back and forth, especially on this map. They'll spawn right where I'm looking, and then they'll spawn right behind me all the time, back and forth, back and forth. Especially if your team's doing good. That's what will happen. Because you'll push into their spawn, they'll start spawning behind you, and it'll happen just back and forth. Uh, I believe I'm using a sleight of hand, and pff, I don't know what other perks. Again, this is like the first week, so I was still trying stuff out, and like, uh, for example, I'm using Mortar Team as a kill streak. Don't do that. Mortar Team is horrible. It's a Gets like one one kill maybe. Um, if you're gonna use a low kill streak that tries to get some kills, use like I don't know napalm strike. Napalm strikes aren't that bad. Um, I use those now. If, like in team deathmatch, I usually run like a UAV, maybe a napalm strike and a blackbird. Two kill streaks that help the team a lot um, are the UAV and the blackbird. That, um, the UAV not so much because Ghost is such a pain in the ass in this game because it uh, it allows people to sit in corners uh, and if you have a UAV out you can't see them. So the other team, you know, they can use six of them will have Ghost on sitting in corners and there's nothing you can do about it. Blackbird on the other hand, Blackbird, oh the Blackbird, one of the best kill streaks that Call of Duty has ever come up with just displays every single person on the map. That is, regardless of whether they have ghost on or not, it's amazing. And it tells you the direction they're going. You can pre-fire people so easily with a blackbird. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of chilling up here in this, this little spot. But, I mean, it's not like the, it's difficult to kill somebody sitting where I'm sitting. Especially since the spawns switch so often. That's why it's so important to have a uh, uh, UAV out. Or uh, at least a UAV, if not a Blackbird. Um, see, I'm using weird kill streaks. I've uh, UAV, um, mortar team, chopper gunner. I don't know, uh, whatever. Um, this was. This is not a good map for chopper gunners. At least I don't think it is, uh, because th this will happen. The other team will be entirely on the other side of the map and then your chopper gunner will take four hours to fly to the other side of the map and by then half the time is run out for the chopper gunner or worst case scenario is like I said earlier they'll switch spawn six times and you won't even get that many kills because they'll switch to the other side by the time your chopper gunner gets over here but luckily that wasn't the case and I get a decent amount of kills right back there where they all spawn. I have a video up, I, I think, by the time this is up, I'll have a video up, of me trying to grab a care package um, that everyone was, I was like, oh, I got a Sam turret, guys, and they're like, oh, put it up, it's a good idea, trust us, it's a good idea to put it up. So I run and I grab it, and because th their entire team was on the other side of the map, so I'm like, oh, I'll grab it, I'll put it up over, th over here in the corner. Their entire team got wiped out, and they all spawned behind me, every single one on the team. So I highly recommend taking taking a look at that video if you want. Um, I think I've got what, uh, what does that look like as a, a special grenade or a tactical grenade as they call them now. I don't know, I think that's Nova Gas, I can't really tell. Um, I lit this guy up with dual pythons. I, I don't usually use dual pythons much anymore. I don't know. I, my favorite's uh, uh, speed reloader uh, with sleight of hand and the speed reloader it seems kind of redundant but it, with only six bolts and a clip it's almost an instant reload so it sometimes comes in handy it, but if, if you have to use your pistol chances are you're shit out of luck because 
in my opinion, all the pistols in this game aren't very good. I, like, I always had a favorite, like in Call of Duty 4, I loved the Deagle. I, I mean, I could probably go pretty positive using just the Deagle, and, uh, Modern Warfare 2, I mean, well, Modern Warfare 2 doesn't really count. You could use a shotgun as a secondary, an automatic shotgun, nonetheless. Um, this game, I just don't like any of the pistols. I don't know what it is. So, I, whoever decided to allow you to put a grenade launcher on this gun is an idiot. I don't know who at Treyarch thought that was a good idea, but it's not at all. Yeah, this gun, this was pre-patch. Um, hey, I revitalized. This, this AK-74U was the pre-patch AK-74U, but the post-patch AK-74U isn't much different. Um, that, but that's another time, another place. I'll, uh, that was a 24-0. A little bit of camping, but that's okay. I will see you guys later.